For more than 150 years, the thunder of hooves has echoed across the Sunshine State, from the sand hills outside of Cunnamulla to the fertile ground that makes up the Darling Downs. Racing has become part of our DNA. And in January each year, the Gold Coast welcomes the world to its shores as more than a thousand of the nation's most promising cults and fillies go through the ring at the Magic Millions. There's no theatre quite like the gavel coming down on the Gold Coast. And in the lead up to the famous Bundle Sales Complex, participants travel from near and far to run their eye over the latest crop of yearlings with hopes of unearthing the next champion. Join us as we go behind the scenes with the legendary Gay Waterhouse as she makes the journey through Queensland's most iconic stud farms. Good shoulder, flat in the weather, going through a growth phase. He'll be good size. Got a presence about himself. Attractive filly. Good bone for bulk moves, really. Nice package. Oh, he's got a beautiful head on him, hasn't he? Breeding within Queensland has a real advantage because of the climate that we're in. You don't experience the same highs and low temperatures as you do in the other states. These horses up here on this Darling Downs country have the best opportunity to develop and grow anywhere in Australia, I believe. Can't beat, you can't beat sunshine to get growth and height and size with a horse. And Queensland's got lots of it. I, I think our climate, our all-round climate, is, 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 the be, is the best climate for horses. Our weather is an obvious one. Uh, here on the Darling Downs we've got great soil, great pastures, so you're laying down super bone with the horses. Mm -hmm.